All right, guys, let's start the workout. Open your feet more than shoulder wide. Let's start with the ground, please. So you bend your legs for two and stretch them back for two. Push your knees to the side. Your toes are looking also to the side. Keep your shoulders above your hips. Beautiful. Bring your hand into your sides. I'm working mirror inverted for you. So my right leg is your left leg. Are you ready? Let's speed it up. We go down and up, down and up. So when you stretch your legs, actively squeeze your glutes. Bring your shoulders back and down. Lift your sternum, open your chest. Good work here. Keep breathing. Feel the power in your front thigh muscles. Relax those muscles in your face. All right, guys. Let's do two pulses here. One, two, and come up. Again, we have one, two, and stretch for three and four. So we have one, two, three, four. Good job. Now let's shift the weight onto the right leg. Bring the left leg to the front. Again, the pulses. One. Two, to the front. Good work. So both pelvic bones are looking to the front. Don't do this. Yeah, let's go. Pulse, pulse, and shift. Stay upright. Pulse, pulse, and shift. So turn the leg out. So bring the heel to the front. Down, down. Let's add another movement. So let's pulse the leg up for two. One. Two, come back down, one, two, lift it up, stay upright, spine is long, do not round yourself, and breathe, stretch the knee, point the foot, bring tension in all your five toes, and think more in length than in height, two pulses at the highest point, and down, down, up, up. Last one. Now hold it in the air. Stay with the pulses and lift it up. Up, up. Good work. Feel the tension. Turn the leg out. So push the heel to the front. Your knee is facing to the side. Think about your posture. Shoulders back and down. Don't move the upper body. Stay steady and calm here. Yeah, let's go. Lift it up. Breathe in through the nose, out through the mouth. Standing leg is still turned out. Last four, three, two. Hold it here now. Bend and stretch. Bend and stretch. Bend and stretch. The little micro bend. Woo! Speed it up. Let's go and stretch. Oh yes, it starts to burn. Let's go. Think in length. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Now let's move in a box. So we move the leg to the bar, down, open again, and lift it up. So move in towards the chair, down to the floor, Open to the side and lift it up. Let's go. Speed it up. In, down, side, and up. Now, when you're moving the leg to the inside, squeeze your thighs together to activate, activate the inner thighs. And in, down, open, and lift up. Imagine squeezing an orange with your thighs here. In, down. And up, in, down, open, and up. Stay upright, four more here. Three more, without moving the pelvis. So both pelvic bones are looking to the front. Hold it at the inside, just squeeze and come up. Are you ready? Speed it up, down, down, down. Squeeze that orange <laughs> between your legs. Both pelvic bones are facing to the front. Don't do this. Woo. Bring those, those thighs together. Seven, six, five, four, three, 
two, one, relax, shake it out. Shake the standing leg out, good work. Front thighs and hip flexors were on fire. This was a burn. So come back into a turned out standing leg position and swipe the leg to the side. Lift it up, now bend the leg. Make sure to open your hip, the leg is at your side. Now lift it up, up and down, up and down. Slightly move your upper body to the side. The left shoulder is moving back and up, down. Now we focus on our lateral thigh muscle and the lateral glutes here. Up, down, up. Standing like a bent. Two more. Hold it in the air for little pulses. Go and up, up. Keep the belly button in and up, engaging your core to protect the lower back. And the last four, three, two. Let's do little circles to the back. Back, so I show you the movement from this side. Don't move the spine. Good work. Spine is steady and calm. Now switch the direction of the circle without moving the upper body. Front, front, yes. Work in full range of motion. Come on, guys. Woo, two more. And hold it at the highest point. Now, little butt kick. So try to stick the heel onto your buttock. Now, we're activating the calf muscle, the back thigh muscle, and a part of the glute. Kick it to, the <laughs> to your booty. Let's go keep the leg in the air. Almost done. Shoulders are moving away from your ears. Four, three, two. Now turn in towards your chair. Close your hips, do not open so both pelvic bones are looking to your chair. Now lower the leg and lift the leg for two. Down, down, up, up. Keep moving. So your leg is bent at a 90 degree angle. The heel wants to come up. The pelvis and the lower back are steady and calm. Do not arch the back. It helps to keep the core activation. Down for two and up for two. Woo! Let's go. Point the foot. Relax those shoulders. Keep the standing leg bent. Are you ready? Let's speed it up. Down and up for one. And up. One. Up. So make sure not to open your hips. We're focusing here on our glutes. So hold it in the air. Now, guys, let's turn it out and drop the knee. So again, turn out without moving the pelvis and turn in. So imagine there's a thread attached at the outside of your thigh and it's pulling the leg up and down. Let's go double time. Up and down. Up and down. Only move the leg, not the hip. Four more here. Four. Three. Two, stay turned out in the so-called attitude position. Lower the leg for two and lift it up again. So lower and lift. Woo, oh yes, the standing leg is working. Ah, last one. And then speed it up on one. Down and up. Down, up. Guys, we can do it together. The last four. Three, prepare yourself for the combination. So hold your leg in the air. Now, turn it in again and lower parallel. And lift it up again parallel and turn it out. So attitude, lower the leg. So the knee is facing to the side and turn in again and lower down. Double time and up, turn out, lower, lift up. Turn in, parallel, drop, up, turn out, drop. Up, turn in, and lower, woo! The last one, and relax, shake it out. Guys, this was a burner. <laughs> so shake it out, let's go over to the other side. 
So we start again in the second ballet position. So open your feet more than shoulder wide. Your toes are looking to the side. And we start again with a ground plie. So bend the legs for two. And come back up for two. Yes. Shoulders stay above your hips. Stay upright. Belly button in and up. And your sitting bones are looking down to the floor. So do not hinge forward. And do not lean back. Stay upright. Everything is in one line. Ear, shoulder, hips, and heels. Are you ready? Speed it up. Let's go down and up. Down. Squeezing the little toe into the floor. This will protect your knees from falling inwards. Down and up. Down and up. Core is activated. Beautiful. The crown of the head is pulling you up to the sky when you stretch your legs, squeezing those glutes. So let's go for two pulses. We have one, two, lift it up for three and four. Again, let's pulse, pulse and stretch. Yes, down, down. Last one. Let's shift the weight onto the left leg. So we go down, down, bring the right leg to the front, back down. One, two, let's shift. Let's go down, one, two, and shift. So pull the leg in with the help of your inner thighs. And stretch the knee. Point the foot. Two more like this before we add the leg lift. Are you ready? Let's pulse up for two. So we have one, two, pulse it up for one, two, down, and lift it up. So again, turn the leg out. So push the heel to the front. Four more rounds to go. Knees to the side. Feel the power in your front thigh muscle. Two more. Last one. Pull it in the air. Little pulses up to the sky. Lift, lift. Without moving the spine. Stay steady and calm here. And breathe. In through the nose, out through the mouth. And the last four, three. We're gonna go for a micro bend, micro bend and stretch. So when you bend the leg, the knee is pushing to the side. So again, turn the leg out. Four, three, two, double time. Let's go and stretch and stretch. Whew. Belly button in and up. Let's go. We have eight more. Seven. Now we're working for hip flexor, front thigh muscle, and the inner thighs. And the last four, three. Let's continue with the movement in the box. So stay stretched. So we go to the inside, drop the leg, move to the side, and bring it back up. So in, down, stretch the knee to the side without moving the pelvis. Double time. Let's go in. Down, side, and up. So both pelvic bones are looking to the front. Now, when your legs and your thighs are coming together, really squeeze them together for activating the inner thighs. And down, open, lift up. Squeeze that orange with the help of your thighs. In, squeeze, out, and up. In, squeeze. Good work. Stay here with the squeeze. We come up and down. Let's squeeze. Both legs are stretched up and down. So cross the standing leg. Double time. Let's go down and down. Down. Yes. Squeeze those thighs against each other. Last four, three, two. Relax. Shake it out. Good work. Let's continue with the series to the side for our lateral thigh muscle. So we had here with the boxing movement, we had the inner thighs. Let's go over to the outer thighs. So swing the leg to the side and bend it. We go up and down for one. So keep your standing leg slightly turned out and bend. And down, up, 
and down. Make sure your knee is not coming to the front. Really open that hip. Give your hip flexor a little bit of length here. Let's go up and down. Shoulders softened and relaxed. Let's hold it in the air. Little pulse up, up, up. Your leg is bent at a 90 degree angle. Right shoulder back and down. Yeah, let's go, let's work. And the last round here, eight, seven, six. I'll show you the movement from this side. And let's continue with the circular movements to the back, back, without moving the upper body. Hold it under control, four, three, two. Switch the direction of the circle to the front. Keeping your leg in the air. Ha. The last four here. Four. Three. Two. Let's continue with the butt kick. So let's kick the heel towards your buttocks to activate the back thigh muscle and the calf muscle. Are you ready? Let's go. Keep moving. Kick. Yes. Point the foot. Woo. Come on, come on. The last eight. Seven, six, belly button in and off. Four, three, let's turn in towards your bar. Let's lower the leg for two and lift it up. So keeping your standing leg bent, your hip is closed. Now we're gonna train our glute muscle. Shoulders soften and relaxed. Core is activated to protect the lower back. Don't arch the back, don't do this, stay here. Keep your leg bent at a 90 degree angle. Speed it up, down and up, down and up. Chest is open. Four more, three more, two. Hold the leg in the air. Now let's turn out and in. So turn it out and in without opening the hips. So don't do this, stay close. So think about the stretch, which is attached at the outside of the leg, which is pulling the leg up and down without moving the pelvis. Up and down. Woo -hoo -hoo. Standing like a bent. Come on. Let's speed it up. Out and in. And eight, seven. Keep your neck in one extension to the rest of the spine. Don't overstretch the neck. Stay turned out. Let's lower the leg for two. We have one, two, lift it up. Yes. Let's fight our way through this exercise together. I know it's burning, especially in the standing leg. Yes, let's go, speed it up. One and one, down. And up. Prepare yourself for the last exercise in which we're gonna combine the first two series. Hold it in the air slowly. Now turn in parallel, drop the leg, lift it up, and turn the leg out. Drop it down and lift it back up. Parallel and release. Double time. Come up and turn out. Drop it and lift. Parallel. In. Up. Turn out. Four. Three. Two. One. Check it out. Woo, guys, amazing. Shake that booty out. Shake those legs out. This was a burner. Guys, thank you for sweating with me.